welcome back to AM Buffalo. We are having a lot of fun here. Of course, I'm with you know who this man is. Paul Stasiak is from the Buffalo Auto Show. Who yeah. <laughs> is joking because I always have to say his full title. He's the president of the Niagara Frontier Auto Dealers Association, but I have trouble when I say N-F-A-D-A. Perfect. Bingo. Oh. Goodness me, we are here at the Buffalo Niagara Convention Centre, downtown Buffalo, for the 2022 Buffalo Auto Show. Of course, it didn't happen last year, Paul. Well, it was virtual. Yeah, we had a virtual show. And yeah. Resounds was good, but nothing like being in person. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. When I walked in here, so when you plan to come to the show, when I walked in here, I was, I felt, whoa. It was almost like going a bit back in time to the good old days when you could actually go to events and, and walk around and see, th oh man, it's, it's awesome. If you are planning on coming to the show, definitely come. Of course, it's over four days, Thursday, tomorrow, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, doors open all days. What doors? What? One o'clock on Thursday and Friday, 10 o'clock on Saturday and Sunday. Beautiful. And then glorious cars, glorious cars. You, of course, can win a car every day. A bit later on in the show, we're giving away tickets which Here Paul's really again. upset about because he wants to sell tickets, but I'm giving them away, so stand by because we're doing that very soon on AM Buffalo. But one thing I wanted to talk to you about, Paul, getting, getting serious about the future of cars, electric vehicles, it's a thing. I think it's the way of the future. I feel like I'm on my last, second last gas car, except for the ones I'm going to collect and turn into unicorns. Um, electric vehicles, a lot of people I find balk because they might park in the street or they're worried about range and all of this sort of stuff. What are you telling people about electric vehicles? These Those days? are legit concerns if, if you don't know what's in store. We, you, everybody talks about the EV of the future. They're the EV of the present. There'll be 77 models available just in local dealerships this year alone. 77. That's impressive. I mean, you're talking BMWs. You're talking Mercedes. You're talking Jaguars, Porsches, high ends, economy cars from Toyotas to Hyundais. So, this show is going to give the public another opportunity to educate. Uh, we're going to have our partners from National Grid, NYSERDA, New York Power Authority, LED Energy, Solar Liberty, in the energy zone, not just to look at cars. Their only function is to show you how you can get a charger at home, how you can get it affordably, where to go if you're not at home, if you're traveling for a trip, AAA's here along with them. How do you map out your trip? Don't be afraid of the future. The range of the cars now are almost three, 400 miles. It's like a full tank of gas. So the public doesn't know that. Um, and, they're, and they're fast, they're, they're, they're just awesome, and the utility to them is getting much better than it was. So it's not a car of the future anymore. We're all in, our dealers are all in, our industry's all in, and now it's our turn to show the public. Two years ago, we started the energy zone with five cars and a couple vendors. We took up a whole room now. Wow, that's amazing. And you know what? Emily Lampa actually checked out the Energy Zone and we have a really cool story on it. So I think we should dive into it. We'll chat some more about electric vehicles after. But let's take a look at what Emily Lampa got up to yesterday in the Energy Zone here at the Buffalo Auto Show at the Niagara at the Buffalo Niagara Convention Center downtown. Check it out. Talking about a behind the scenes look at setup here at the Buffalo Auto Show, we are now here on the catwalk high above the Buffalo Niagara Convention Center. One. No pressure. <laughs> Energy Zone. <gasps> and it pops open. Nice. How do I look? Well, we're 
thrilled to be here and it's long overdue, right? We yep. haven't had an auto show for a couple of years, so we're excited to be back. And BMW has been waiting for this event because we've had electric cars on the market and now with this latest generation, we have the newest technology and now we can show it off. So this is called the iX and this is BMW's sport activity vehicle. Um, it's completely electric with a range of over 300 miles and what's beautiful is with a fast charge battery, you can recharge in as little as 15 minutes. What? Yeah. That so charge it overnight, take a trip, stop for coffee, and you're ready to get back on the road. So this is on loan from BMW because, of course, um, we have low inventory with all manufacturers right now, but they were kind enough, enough to send us this car because this is the model that they're displaying at all the bigger auto shows. So I know that electric vehicles are cool in themselves, but BMW took the wow factor even even a little bit farther. Check this out. They have Swarovski crystal. Oh yeah, crystal details throughout. Oh my gosh. And check out the glass roof on this baby. This car is not only beautiful and sporty, but it's just so glamorous. We love electric vehicles because they're known for glass roofs and BMW offers that as well. We have orders right now and you could be one of the first in Buffalo to have this car. They'd be arriving early this summer. So this is our i4 electric sedan. And what's nice about this is we've seen this shape. This is the newest from BMW in a four door sport sedan. We call it a sport coupe. But what's beautiful is in the all electric engine, you can really get the same range. You can get that 300 mile range, but you can also also be under the $60,000 price tag. And with BMW, you're not sacrificing any power or any handling or any of the ultimate driving machine. You're getting everything that BMW is known for, but with that new electric feature that just makes it better than ever. We're ready, you know, we're ready and now we're ready to show it off. Wow, that is awesome. I'm excited for the future of cars. I have this, I don't know if I can sing it on TV because we might have to pay the rights for the song, but you know the Electric Blue song? Instead of like singing Electric Blue, I sing Ele Electric Car. Try singing that song and singing Electric Car instead. I can't do it, I'm not, <laughs> I'm running the show. If, if I say... <laughs> it's called Ass Cap, I can't do that. Yeah, exactly, that's why I'm steering away from it. Um, you know what? I have tickets to give away, so if you want to come to the 2022 Buffalo Auto Show, Paul Stasiak is not happy about it. He wants you to buy your tickets. BuffaloAutoShow.com for tickets, <laughs> top stashes, tickets consumer beverage. Stick around. We'll be back in a moment on AM Buffalo. He might not be with me. <laughs>